Thursday the 28th, I think. I have a terrible cold, but we didn't let that to slow us down. Went and got a new Speckled Park bull calf today. We're pretty happy about him. He looks fantastic. It's kind of a miserable day to go get a calf. We are once again suffering through winter. We had a foot of snow, it all melted. We had two nice days. And now we've had this, just, just a pile of snow. So yeah, it's, uh, this is what you want when you've got a bad cold, I'll tell you that. Nice weather like this. So it's Friday morning, April 29th. I still have a cold, that's still a lot of fun. It's been snowing for like three days now. And, and it's just, it's incredible the amount of snow we have. It's just insane. And uh, so we just called Daisy in and she's uh, slowly, slowly chugging up. The snow will be very deep there too. So, um, yeah, we, uh, we sure would like some spring sometime soon. Like, it's just, it's too much snow. It's too much snow. <laughs> Come on, Daisy. That's a good girl. In you go. Now we'll clean her up, we'll get milkers on her, get her milked out for the day. Milk just pours out of her. She has been green. It's a fair deal. They're sucking away. I had a hard time finding where I was today because of the deep snow. Oh. Like a hard time getting to you or even yeah. coming out of their shelters? No, they were out. But just finding where I was because everything's hidden by snow. Yeah. Do they look dry and... Uh, been out for a little bit, they look a little bit wet, but I think they were in their shelters all night. Okay. They're hungry, that's for sure. What about you, Doodler? What do you think of all this snow, huh? What do you think of all this snow? What do you think of all this snow? Yeah. Fusses, everybody just drinks, eh? Yeah. That's good. I almost feel like we were a little premature moving them outside, but who would know we'd get this kind of snow on April 29th? I know. And they're done. This is our new calf, doing really well. Nice speckled park bull calf. And uh, it's our last one to feed this morning. But he's doing really good. He's lucky he's in here with a nice straw bed, not out in the wilderness snow. And there he is, done. Done for the day or for the morning. We'll be back tonight with some more. Huh, little guy? Little guy? Yeah. Yeah, you're a good calf. 
ducks don't look too thrilled with the situation either. You guys came here for spring, not for winter. Got shafted. So, there we go. We fed three calves and we still brought a gallon in the house. That's why we milk a Holstein and not a Jersey. Volume. All right, so this morning's developments were, uh, were poor. Um, this is my truck stuck at the end of the laneway. We now got the big old tractor here. We're gonna try and pull it out. And, uh, also, if you look down the road a little bit, that's as far as Sarah made it this morning. Before she, well, she actually made it a little farther and she tried to back up and got stuck. And then I tried to come get her and I also got stuck. So, yeah, we're gonna do our best here. All right, so, spent the morning pulling some, uh, trucks out of the snow here in Sarah's car and now we uh, <laughs> we took the opportunity to feed because everybody was just about out of feed so uh, we figured doing it on the snow would better wait for it all to melt and doing it in the mud I don't know if that's right or not but it's what we did now I'm gonna park this thing and uh, hopefully that holds us for a week and this stuff will all melt, dry up, and, uh, and we can do it proper. But, oh, what a pain. Like, three days ago we had no snow. Now look at this. And it's all going to melt. We're supposed to be uh, up in the mid-teens in the next little bit here. And it was just, just a gong show of a morning. So here's what my corral area looks like today. Today being Friday. And uh, these weathers in here, who were supposed to go to market before Easter already, and it's now the 29th of April. Um, the guy just called and said he'd like to come get them on Sunday. I said, man, you couldn't have picked a worse day. You just couldn't have picked a worse weekend. So somehow I got to figure out a way to get a truck down here and pick these guys up. And I don't know what the heck I'm going to do about that yet. Cause there is just a pile of snow and the snow is piled on top of mud. So I wonder if maybe I'll just try and lead these sheep out of here and up, up to the barn where you can get them better. That might be a better plan.